subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon for the latest updates. Hello everyone, it's Asus Johan from Asphere Creation. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you all guys are doing extremely well. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can edit your couple photographs in Photoshop. You can also edit your pretty wedding photos in Lightroom. So we're gonna open the Lightroom. Before getting to the Lightroom, just press the like button on this video so that it will motivate me to make more videos and press it just like this for you guys. And if you still haven't subscribed to our channel, then do subscribe and hit the notification icon to get latest updates. Also visit our website that is www.asphericreations.com. From there you can download backgrounds, camera preset, Lightroom preset and every kind of photo editing stuff just for free. Also follow me on Instagram. Let's jump to the beautiful world of Lightroom. Now let's open the Lightroom and just you know go to the import. Let's browse the our photograph which we want to edit. Now here is our photograph. Now let's select the import. Now click on this and go to the develop tab. Here is the raw image. Now all you need to do is let's just make a color correction. First of all we will just go to the hue and just move this to around minus 40 or 50 or something like that. Now from the red primary just move it to plus 10. Increase the saturation if you want to increase. Now from the primary color you can make it as a pinky stone. Now here we are gonna add some vignette on the image so that it may look you know very much kind of realist uh, moody type or a cinematic type photograph. Now go to the HSL tab and select the green color and just move the slider to kind of a green color whichever you wanna make just you can make it. And from the aquaton you can just select whichever color you want and all on the blue tone you can also just browse the color now here I want to increase the green saturation so you can increase or decrease the grass from here green grass now all you need to do is let's just increase some kind of contrast on the image decrease the shadows and just reduce some whiteness increase the blackness if you want to increase and let's give this temperature a kind of cool blue tone or brown or whichever you want you can just make it or kind of green tone you can also make green plus blue tone minus 21 and minus 10 you can just make now from the tone goes just press on this icon one point over here and one point over here and just move it to the blackness so that it will give you a matte look on the image which we actually want so just keep it somewhere over here this will be pretty much perfect now now let's add some shadows on the image so let's select this bluish color you can take any of the shadows if you want but I want a blue color so just uh, take the bluish shadow and just decrease the saturation a little bit to minus plus 15 and let's add the highlights on the image you can just do whatever kind of highlight is more suitable you can just keep that one let's 
let's add this yellow stone which is really making your photograph amazing look so finally here we have almost done the process now if you want to add some kind of filters you can just click over here and on over this portion you can just you know add some exposure from here you can just you know decrease the exposure or the lightness this will you make your photograph to look very much you know moody and pretty much cinematic so rest of all you can just uh, adjust it from here decrease the shadows increase the clarity and you can give the saturation to plus 8 this one is really looking very much you know cinematic and kind of look giving the photograph a very awesome look you can just add the feathers now hit done so finally here you can see your photograph is turned into very cinematic color tone effect here is the before and here is the after so this is how you can just edit your wedding photos or you know couple photographs or pre-wedding photos in very kind of in a cinematic look if you want to give it you can use this technique to use your color grade your photographs in Lightroom so I hope you all guys have enjoyed the video and if you enjoyed then just press the like button on this video so that it will motivate me to make more videos and press it just like this for you guys if you still haven't subscribed to our channel then do subscribe and hit the notification icon to get latest updates also visit our website that is www.assurgations.com from there you can download backgrounds camera preset lightroom preset lut's and every kind of photo editing stuff just for free also follow me on instagram and if you want to save this preset you can just click on this plus icon and you can name any of the preset like this abc <coughs> pre-wedding photo pre-wed pre-wed a1 so just click on the create so all these color adjustment would be saved as your preset now if if you want to save this then just right click on it and select export and just click on the export so it would be automatically saved in your desktop untitled export folder that is here so here you can see your photograph is saved so this is how you have to save your photograph now if you want to you know add just uh, do the same adjustment in other photograph then we have already made this preset now all you need to do is just uh, go to the library and let's import some more images let's take this photograph or or let's take this image and just go to the develop tab now here is our photograph and just click on this see you can see the huge difference this preset i would be giving you for free so you can see the difference your photograph is turned into very you know kind of amazing cinematic look so this is how you can you know, create your photograph to look very much amazing and a moody let's take one more example image here is the before let's give this preset so you can see it is really looking very much amazing this preset would i would be giving you in the description also so you can use it in your photograph to look very much you know amazing so I hope you enjoyed the video and, and if you enjoyed then just press the like button so that you know it will motivate me to make preset like this for you guys. So guys thank you for watching and bye bye to the next video.